Hey, what's up everybody? Thanks for tuning in. It's your boy Django Mike here. So check it out. Today's video is kind of like um, a Frankenstein creation of a few things. I spent about a week with my son and my youngest daughter up near Yosemite. Now between Yosemite, Bass Lake, and some of my little backcountry spots out there, we got some footage from, of fishing, but the thing is like, I wasn't really trying to film too much. It's kind of just enjoying the moment, spending time with my family. And also I was meeting some relatives up there as well. So like between like the hiking and the fishing, I just, I didn't film as much as I probably should have because it was a pretty good trip. We got a lot of good fish. But anyways, I just thought I'd throw this together, some of the cast to catch and then some of the stuff that we caught. So I'm just, there's a really short video, but I promise you there's some good stuff in there. Some beautiful footage for the people that like to just watch for the environment and people that just like to watch to see the experiences. I figured might as well throw up something, right? So anyways, with that being said, go ahead and enjoy the video. Bass. A little bass. Check it out. It's like 48 degrees out. A little colder and cloudy than when I'm normally here. This is kind of, this weather's been like unusually cold. So even this spot, I haven't been here when the weather's been like this in a long time. Um, but yeah, still pulling them out. Um, Good looking fish. It's small, you know, but it's okay. Like, I like small fish. I'm gonna get a picture, give him a kissy, and get him back in the water. <laughs> Keep reeling. That's a big ass bluegill. Oh, it's a crappie over here, over here. They have a big ass crappie. Dang. Jimmy, what the heck? That's the biggest crappie I've ever seen. Now turn them towards me. That is your first crappie, and that is a big one. Oh. All right, so the little munchkin got herself a big ass crappie. Good looking sucker. We're gonna let him go though, because catch and release, baby, all day. You wanna give it a kiss? <laughs> all right, here we go. Hi. There we go. Yeah. He's a bass, yeah. Yeah, buddy. Oh, a bass buddy. All right. Another little guy. We can get. Okay. Last time. Later on that day, my homie Dr. Dre came through with a gang of tangle ray. So check it out. We're here at Bass Lake, California, which is just outside the south entrance of Yosemite, uh, which is one of my favorite places in the world. And Bass Lake has a lot of meaning to me as well. Uh, it's a family tradition. To come here every summer we have a spot not too far from here not too far from this cove where we all camp it's what we do um anyways long story short i'm here with my son and my daughter my youngest and we're going to visit some family who are visiting from texas they wanted to go to yosemite i offered my guide services because i know yosemite in and out um so we just kind of we're killing some time until they get here and i was like hey let's go to bass lake and just mess around and so we started just, I just rigged up trout rigs because I figured it's cold. 
the bass weren't really biting and within like man like five minutes of my first cast i caught i think the largest rainbow trout i've ever caught um at least that i weighed so uh that's gonna be dinner like rainbow trout is delicious so we're gonna be cooking that then my youngest daughter phoenix who just outfished me with trout fishing last week caught, an caught another nice one so i guess we're gonna be here for a minute while we wait for my cousins to, to show up it's pretty cool but it's a beautiful lake it's just a little colder than normal right now um it's uh early march usually by now i i, I kind of feel like my memory served me right that it's usually warmer by now but we've been getting just like rain cold weather snow all kinds of weird stuff yeah it's good stuff keep it up keep it high yeah i got you feet yeah feed me i to take a picture of her i'm in the middle of tying i can't Is that a big one? Yeah, Beanie. That's like two trout in a week. <laughs> Keep it high, okay? Okay, so as, as it gets closer, you're gonna drag him to the shore. Keep it high, keep it high. Okay, walk back, drag him to the shore. Yeah, kiddo! Woohoo! Oh, we can actually give me those pliers. Where? Give me the pliers and give me the um, the weight or the, the scale. Here you go. I thought there was a fish on. Come up here, Phil. 1.5. This feels like a good one. Is it filming? Or? Yeah. Yeah, I was just kind of dicking around with the kids. We're like, let's throw a trout rig, fuck it. And we got hit like right away. Something nice. Yeah, it looks like a nice big old lake trout. Look at that sucker. Ooh, be careful. Ooh, that's a big one. That's huge. That's the biggest trout I ever caught. <laughs> that thing's a slab of meat. Big old lake trout. Look at that sucker. Big old rainbow. We're going to cook this guy, you know? Uh, that's how it goes. I literally... We just came to this lake spot to chill. I actually had to use the bathroom and I was like, screw it. Let's just throw out some trout rigs. Like kind of not really thinking much about it. And I helped my daughter throw out one. And then I went and threw out mine. Like within a minute, it hit. So good thing I had the GoPro so they could turn it on. Ah, shit. Holy shit. <laughs> All right, pointed at me. Remember, waist up, hat on the top. Get in my belly! Looks like we got... 3.8 Dang! Yeah man, gotta go ahead and cut it off and... Uh...